Okay, well, thank you everybody for joining us tonight. My name is Lisa Yan. I'm from Rochester, New York. And tonight you were invited on here by, I'm assuming an amazing friend or maybe an associate that thought about you because you're in the industry that one of us have been in, are in, and thought, hey, you know what? My friend needs to hear about this. And that's the, the beauty industry. I'm not just going to say hairstylist because, you know, we got nail techs, we got massage therapists, we got estheticians. Um, but the, the ones you're going to hear from tonight, we're all st um, stylists or former stylists. And just want to share a little bit about what this opportunity um, from the Happy Co has um, offered us and what it could possibly offer you. And like I said, my name is Lisa Yan. I'm from Rochester, New York. And for 25 years, I was that stylist. And um, I was always one of the youngest stylists in the salons that I worked at. I worked um, for corporate before. I worked for private. I went and worked for my, you know, rented a chair, then to finally working for myself. And at one of the last salons that I um, rented a chair from, the oldest lady that worked there was in her, she was in her early 60s. And the only way her clients that she had room to put new clients in was if one passed away. And she was constantly, it was, yeah, it, it was, it's the truth. And it was the back combing, it was the teasing, it was all those things. And then it was every time she, and she only worked Friday and Saturdays. And she would come in and she was complaining about this aching and that aching. And I'm just like, oh my gosh, like, I don't want to be that person. Like, I want to retire. And I put a number in my head and I said 45. And everybody was like, yeah, right, whatever. You're never going to make it happen. Well, um, almost four years ago, this um, opportunity uh, came to me. And you guys, I was taking, you know, some of the stories you're going to hear, it was the product first. And for me, it was the opportunity. Um, I didn't even know what the products were. And um, I was sold on the vision. And I was sold on I'm not going to lie, the money. I was. And um, when the box arrived at my house and I realized it was coffee, I was like, what? I don't even drink coffee. And so I was like, oh, well, when in Rome, do what the Romans do. Well, earlier that year, I had started my weight loss journey because I was 42-ish and I knew I needed to get my life together. I had a son that depended on me. I had a mom that depended on me and I knew I just needed to get healthier. So I started losing weight. And I started, you know, I had lost about 20 pounds and then I kind of plateaued and I went to Dallas for this opportunity and I had bought a size 12 jeans. Uh, fast forward a couple of weeks, the product showed up at my door. I started taking it and I was already signed up as a partner, building my business, started taking the product. And like I said, it was that day I just popped the pill, drank the coffee and I went to the gym. And as I was on my way, the girl, one of my team members said, Hey, can you do a three-way call for me? I'm like, sure. Get to the gym. I'm on the stair stepper thingy. And about an hour later, she goes, are you still on that machine? And I said, yeah. She's like, Lisa, we've been on the phone for an hour. I was like, whoa, didn't even phase me. And within a month. So that was like the week of Thanksgiving by my birthday, December 27th, I dropped a whole pant size. So I went from that 12 to a 10. And since then I have went to a size six. And I know that has nothing to do with the industry um, of hair. Um, but the one thing that I love to share about this, this opportunity, I've been in network marketing businesses before you guys, and I did make good money, but nothing that I could that would have made me replace an income. So within seven short months of doing this business, not only did it allow me to retire almost three years early, but it, it tripled my income. And I, that was the one thing where a lot of people used to tell me that they could never give up hair because they could never give up that money. They could never find something that could replace that money as fast. And I'm here to tell you it can happen. And, you know, there's been times people say, can you fit me in? Can you still do? And I'm like, nope, like I'm retired. I know someone on here is going to say that they still do it for friends and family. My list is about this little, um, that I still do it for. Do I love it? I do, but I love doing this more and I love the time and freedom that it gives me. So I am going to go ahead and send this over to my beautiful friend, Misty Sarvis down in North Carolina. Take it away, my friends. Hey, hey guys. Thank y'all for having me on tonight. 
So yeah, so my name, my name is Misty Sarvis. I am from a very small town in um, North Carolina called China Grove. Um, I've been doing hair now for 24 years, so I'm just right behind you, Lisa. Um, and it's crazy to even say that I've been doing it for 24 years because gosh, I don't feel like I'm that old, but my, I guess I am, you know? <laughs> but yeah, but so I've been blessed, you know, my whole life, I really have. I've never had to go without food or without a warm house to live in, you know, like so many people have. I mean, there's so many unfortunate people out there. And for that, I'm forever grateful. But what I didn't have was all the extra stuff. Um, you know, excuse me, if anything ever broke, like the washing machine, the dishwasher, your car, you know, or whatever it might be, we didn't have the money to fix it. We didn't have any extra money in savings. And so I literally had to go and ask like my sister or my mom or my dad if I could borrow, you know, the money. So I literally lived week to week checking my um, checking account balance multiple times a day. And I'll never forget when Paxton was smaller, every time we went to Walmart, he always thought he was supposed to get a new toy. And he thought that because his cousin, who is the exact same age as him, and who lives right beside of us, always got something. I mean, he got something every single time that went somewhere. So of course Paxton thought that was the norm and he was supposed to too. So I tried to keep up with him, I really did. And I did for a little while, but you know, finally I just couldn't. And I had to sit him down and tell him, look, you know, Maddox is always gonna get more than you get. And the sooner that you realize that and understand it, the better off you're gonna be. And I really think it was that conversation that kind of lit some kind of fire in me. And so I got online and, you know, started Googling what are some different ways to make money online. And um, so I talked to a few different people who did different things. One thing led to another and that's how I ended up here. And I can honestly tell you, this is my forever home. I will never leave to go anywhere else. Um, the people in this company are the most caring, loving, welcoming, welcoming, this, that's even a word, the most welcoming people I've ever met. You know, it doesn't matter who you are or what you look like or where you've been, what your past is. In our company, we're all one. And I think that that makes a huge difference in so many different companies. And, you know, our motto is one team, one dream. But I've been with this company now for three and a half years and it's truly changed my life. Um, before, you know, we didn't have any extras and now we have all the extras. Um, I can literally, you know, buy my kids things when they ask and there's no more checking my account balance multiple times a day because I just know that there's always gonna be money in there. And that, my friend, is just a truly incredible feeling. <clears throat> um, but because of this little side business that I have, I am actually still in the salon, but I only work two days a week. And it's completely my choice. I have tripled my hair income, um, easily tripled it. But, um, but yeah, I totally probably will not ever quit doing hair because um, you know, I work too hard to build up my clientele just to walk away. And that's how I look at it. So many other people, you know, got out of it, like Lisa, and that's great too. It's just to each their own on that. But yeah, I totally will probably always do hair. But, you know, guys, with the world like it is today, you know, everything is so crazy. There's truly no better time to start your own business from where you can work it from home or the beach or wherever you may be, you know, time's gonna pass anyway. So the way I look at it is why not put more extra money in your wallet versus your boss's wallet? That's a little bit about my story. But um, again, thank you so much for having me on, Lisa. Absolutely. Thank you, Misty. 
Um, and you guys, she's so right. And you know what? She can build her clientele with her clients and this business the same way I did. Like I literally, I wish I should have put, we don't have bags anymore, but let's just say this was a bag of our sticks. Now they're boxes. I literally stuck the bag on my station and it said weight loss management coffee. And people are like, what? I mean, we were, it was just crazy. People were wanting it and it, that's all I did. So I was working two businesses at one once. So if you're thinking, I don't have time to do this on top of being in the salon 12 hours a day, because I was that girl, I was 12 hours a day. My son wouldn't see me. Like there were times I think back, you know, I hear people tell their stories about their little kids and I'm like, I, I didn't get that because there were times from Thursday to Saturday, I wouldn't see my son. And if he went out of town with my parents on Friday after school, I didn't see him sometimes until Sunday afternoon when they came back. And that was like the worst feeling. Easter egg hunts, going to see Santa. Yeah, check that off the list. Lisa didn't get to do those, do those things. So I love the fact that I get to help other moms make that come true for them because those are horrible things you never want to miss. So now I'm going to turn it over to my good friend Tracy who is in western or upstate New York I'm western she's upstate so take it away my friend hey everybody how you doing tonight um, my name is Tracy Bove Meislewick and I live in upstate New York um, I actually have you guys both be I have had my cosmetology license for 32 years so I've been doing that since I was 18 now, but um, I have my cosmetology license. I have my real estate license and just about two, well, it was just, it'll be three years in February. So two and a half years I've been in this business. I've never had any network marketing experience before. And um, I just saw a random post on Facebook. I jumped in because of the product. I was looking for something to give me some energy. I was exhausted all the time and couldn't keep up with my life, my family, my job, whatever. And so after like day two of drinking the coffee, I'm like, oh my God, this is amazing. I need to sell this. What do I have to do? I got in touch with the girl who I ordered it from and I knew instantly it was a, an, an impact product, but I also knew I could really make a business out of it. And, you know, you guys all know people in the cosmetology industry, you know, our clients trust us. They trust us with their hair. That is their most prized possession practically. You know, they trust us with our family secret, their family secrets. They trust us with their lives. Literally, we're like their counselors. And if we have products for them that can help them, they're going to be all in. They want to jump right in and listen to us because they know we are honest with them and we have, we've built up those relationships. But um, what this opportunity has done for me is, you know, like Misty said, you know, I, I have a pretty decent, comfortable life. You know, my husband has a good job, but same thing. Like we wanted to go on vacations and things were kind of like, Oh, do we, we have five kids between the two of us. So taking, you know, seven of us to Disney or anywhere is a big expense. So since I started this business, I no longer do real estate anymore. I've gone down to just one day a week because kind of like Misty, you know, these are my family and my friends. And, you know, that's pretty much the only time I get to see them on a regular basis is when they come once, you know, like, like I said, I just work the one day a week now. So I see them once every couple of weeks. Um, but so doing that, um, gives me the freedom to work this business full time. I don't do real estate anymore. I just work this business full time. I work one day a week at the salon. This business works around any schedule anybody could possibly have. And, you know, it's helped me pay off all of my credit card debt. It's helped us do home repairs. It's helped us on vacations. Like we've met the best friends in the entire world. We just got back from Utah. And, you know, another thing, I just earned this trip to Mexico in April. So for my husband and I, you know, so like the things that this business has afforded us is absolutely incredible. And, you know, we make it so simple, so duplicatable that anybody can really do it with experience or without. It's just honestly an amazing opportunity. So thank you, Lisa. Yes, that's so awesome. And like she said, you guys can work this in the nooks and crannies of your day. I would put color on one person's hair, cut the other person, and then in between send messages out or make their coffee so they could try it while they were in my chair. And that is like, the other thing is like, I had one girl, I'll never forget it. She was like, I'm so tired. And she would not stop yawning. I was like, girl, let me just make you a cup of coffee. And I ran over to the Keurig real quick, put the hot water in there, made it for her. And within 15 minutes, she stopped yawning. 
And that later that afternoon, she said, my plan was to go home and take a nap. And I've gotten all the things done that was on my list to do for the week. And I was like, yes. And she became, she's still to this day, a customer like that is like, our products are just so impactful. So now we save the best for last to send it out to sunny California to Shanice. Let me just go ahead. How are you? I'm great. How are, how's everyone doing? Um, thank you so much for having me on here and being able to share uh, my story. Uh, I can relate to all of you guys. I've been doing hair probably the least. I've been doing it for 16 years, um, but it feels like a long time. And, you know, I, I love my job. I love doing hair, but I always knew like I stood behind the chair for, you know, 10 to 12 hours a day, five to six days a week, because it was just what I did. And, um, you know, fast forward, I got pregnant, I had a baby and, you know, um, we don't get like maternity leave or anything like that. So I had a C-section and went back to work at three weeks on the day, which I wasn't allowed to, but I did it because I had to, I had to, I had still had to pay rent, you know, and I didn't have anything else to like help me with income. So I went back, I was feeling very sluggish, very tired, not myself because I was this new mom. I also gained 53 pounds. I'm five, two, you guys. So that was a, a good amount for me to put on. And I was like, oh my gosh, how am I going to get this off? What am I going to do? And a really good friend of mine was like, you need to try these products. They're amazing. I promise you, they will not let you down. I'm like, give them to me. I don't care. So tried it having, so I was the one who really joined. I wanted to get the discount on the products. I wasn't thinking of creating a business right away because I was already so busy. I was always that girl thinking like, I'm too busy for any of this stuff. I can't do it, which is such a lie because <laughs> anybody could do it really. And then, um, 2020 happened and I became in the looking zone, which is, uh, you know, I didn't, we all didn't have a job and it was kind of scary. So I'm like, you know what, these products have helped me so much. And I, I feel like I can share this. So I just started, I started with one simple post of what it did for me. And I was shocked at the reaction that I got from people because there were so many people out there that were feeling the same way, like same way I was needed something for energy mood. And we were just in a, everyone was in a weird spot and, you know, people were looking for something. And so we started building a team. I started helping other moms and other people who didn't have a job, like start building something. So it was just like this ripple effect that made me feel even better that I was like doing more than just helping one or two people behind the chair a day, which is crazy. So from this, it has just been an, a complete blessing because I went from five to six days a week to now two days a week. And I got to spend my entire summer um, up in Oceanside. We have a little trailer up there in San Diego. And I mean, it makes me cry because I feel like I'm able to give my daughter this amazing, you know, these memories that I'm going to have where I would only see her maybe two to three hours a day when I was working you know, at the salon. So it's just been, it's been such a huge, huge blessing and anyone can do this. And I'm actually really thinking about completely stopping eventually. I mean, I love what I do. It's not even work. It's so fun to go and play, but I just feel like this is just so amazing and I can help so many more people on a bigger spectrum. And anyone could do it, you know? So if you guys were invited on this call, please like reach out to them because this opportunity has, it does change lives and it could be something huge for you too. And I know that what we have coming is going to be even bigger and better. So like, just get ready. Like I'm, I'm so excited. I'm so grateful to be a part of such an amazing community and team of people. And yeah, I'm just, thank, thank you guys for letting me share. I appreciate it. Absolutely. So I'm pretty sure you guys can find one of us that you can resonate with, whether you've been in the industry of doing hair or in the beauty industry, let's just say that, you know, for five years, up to 30 years, there's someone on here that you can resonate with. And, you know, for myself, you know, being 25 years in, um, it was, my body was starting to take the wear and tear. I also knew a woman who had carpal tunnel surgery four times on one hand. 
And I was like, my gosh, my hand was starting to, I had, uh, I forget what they call it, but this like lump. And it was because this was the hand I blow dried with. And that's finally completely gone. My shoulder was um, just the rotator cuff from the constant you know, motion of the blow drying. I was getting plantar fasciitis in my right foot. So I was a hot mess. Left shoulder, right foot. Like it was awful. I was off. It was horrible. But I can honestly say I don't have that stuff anymore. I mean, maybe it's due to some of the products, you know what I mean? Those aches and pains, not being on my feet as much. And, you know, being able to give my, you know, my help my son do whatever he wants to do or help my mom, like that has been like the true, the biggest blessing for me. And to not have to, like Misty said, check your bank account before you make a purchase. Oh, we're going out to lunch today. Let me just make sure. Or, you know, let me pay cash instead of this or whatever. It's just, it's been a true blessing. So if you're someone that, you know, you're like, I really need to do something else, but I just don't know get with the person who invited you back here because we can all, we all work together. None of us on the screen right here. Well, maybe one we're on the same team, everybody else, you guys, we're just friends, but we come together and work together no matter what. And so, um, with that being said, we wanted to keep it short and brief because we know it's Sunday night and kiddos got to go to bed. So you guys have a great night and we hope to see you soon. Have a great night. Bye everybody. Thank you. Thank you everyone. It was great.